we met a few years ago, no? Some years back, ano? Dahil yes, nag-T3 yeah, yeah. ka. Yeah, oh, <laughs> T3. Ano ba yung may tagline yun, eh, di ba? T3, ang bumangga. Kiba. Kiba. <laughs> Tatlong magkakapatid na pulpo. Okay. Okay, brought to television. Talaga, not just one, three. And I remember, it struck me uh, very distinctly, no? Mm. When one of the first things you told me is that, in explain mo, why the sunglasses, why the mustache, and why the jacket? Okay. The reason is because we're three brothers. Para kami pinagbiak na kamatis para sa iba magkapareho. Sometimes, nung araw kay, nung araw to ano? That was before, but if you look at that, you know, siguro T3 days, nalilito sila. Oh, tama so, yan. Hindi nila alam. Hindi nila alam. Oh. Pas, that tool. <laughs> Mas alam nila magkakapatid uh, yan. Right, right, They right. don't know a Ben, a Rabi, yeah, yes, yes. from a Mon and Irwin. Yes. Kasi ang siling na, para kay pinagbiak na kamatis. Mm. Hindi na namin narinig yan. Kaya, you know, one of the things, when I wear my sunglasses, my grade to, at saka, I cannot stand the, the glare of the light. So, ginamit ko na yun as a brand. So sunglasses. I have to wear a mustache to identify na si Ben ako. And si Rafi is a clean cut guy. Si Erwin is another, you know, uh, makikita mo sila. Magkamukha sila yung nabka. Well, that was before. So I have to... And the jacket? Yes. The jacket? Yes, I, yes. I liked your explanation about why you always wear a jacket. Usually blazer yan eh. Yes, yes, yes. So, but nga ba? Because I carry... Uh, I carry... I'm a licensed gun holder. Yo. So because of my job. I mean, uh, true to who I am, I'm, a, I'm a, you know, handguns, a martial artist. So it's one of those things na makikita mo to conceal. So that dito, meron sa loob. At least yeah, dati. Yeah, yeah, not is, right now. Wala akong ano. Not, not right now. now. <laughs> so yung part ng look, ano, alam mo, sa mga batang 80s, uh, Ben, ano yan eh, Miami Vice, yung may naging peg mo nun. It seems like that, but 80s pa yun eh. Now, I was more of a denim and a blazer guy. Oh, yon. Si Miami Vice kasi is more of a slack guy, and, oh, you know, sneaker. But ako kasi more blazer and denim lagi. You, you, talaga, all throughout denim. So. so the jacket was supposed to suggest that there's a gun inside. Mm, just, sometimes just, there is, sometimes there's not. Yes. Uh, kaya ako minsan nasanay na ako kayo sa labas. But on TV, it was really my branding. It was just like, you know, a fashion statement. Mm. <laughs> so how much, how much of this, no, Ben, is uh, marketing, and how much of it is real? Well, <clears throat> the real, if I take my jacket, t-shirt, and then, because I'm here, I have to, you know, of course, follow a little bit of the dress code. Pag salabas ako, rubber shoes, denims lang t-shirts, we blended in sa crowd. Walang arte. You can let me eat sa karinderia, fast food. Because I like to blend in. You can let me walk in the mall, you know, kahit saan. Okay, another thing, the tulfos are known to roll with an entourage. Right? Yes. Si Erwin, may bodyguard dyan. Yes, yes. <laughs> may backup yan. Yeah. Si Rafi, ganun din. May backup at yes. bodyguard, ano? Parang ikaw, do you have bodyguards? Do you also roll the same way? With an entourage? Um, if you ask me, you know, I... I Parang I, I, hindi kasi eh. I want to be private, but, but, alam mo, Pat, you don't really, the, the nature of our job, especially sa akin, an investigator that I exposed, uh, you know, it's always nice na tabla yung laban. Mm -hmm. Because hindi ka naman si Iron Man, si Superman, si Batman, na hindi ka tabla. And it's always nice that you have a lot of people according to have security. Because if not, I don't think you're thinking right or limitado ka. So, I want my bodyguards medyo distant sa akin. May protocol kami. Is, do, you, do you really need bodyguards? Yes. Is the threat real? Well, or is this real, part of the image and the branding? In the real world, I live in a real world. Authentic ako eh. Marami na ako nasagasan with all the drug raids, bank robbery. Pwede kasi akong balikan 10 years, 5 years ago. So, consistently defending the weak the faceless and the voiceless to which I'm still doing, nakakasagasa ka. I mean, the last two years, two years, you know, nababangga ako yung mga hardcore politicians who are basically, you know, parang they, they seem to, you know, test you. So... What I'd like to know is, has there ever been an incident when actually munti ka na, ikaw, and that warrants the need for, let's say, armed 
bodyguards with you? Um, sa amin kasi, tinitingnan namin ang mga lakad namin. Di numero kami pagkumilos. Um, uh, bahay, opisina, and places that I go limited doon sa mga places. You know, it warrants na may mga bagay na the challenges issued. Na pag nakita tayo, magkakamayan tayo or iiwas tayo or you know, it become a last man standing, which means that's a threat to my life. You, 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 you're, you're issuing a threat. I will take it. But you there's mean, never been an incident. Well, kasi umiiwas din sila. Mm. I mean, it happens in 2008, okay. dreaded, you know, bank robbers, uh, Alvin Flores. Iba kasi. Ang hirap eh, nakikita mukha mo dun sa drug operations before. That was before nung panahon ni Gloria Macapagal Arroyo. And then kay, uh, you know, kay Pinoy and also kay Duterte. So, we, we know, those were the times that I go. Talagang totoo. We were there. So... Are you saying you've actually really made um, big enemies? Yes. And For real. Enemies who could have actually threatened your life. Well, if you look at my young aming channels on uh, YouTube, tingnan mo lang kung sino mga negation ng challenges. Hmm. And I take the challenge na pag ako hinamon, I'll take it. Okay. Which means, tutu, tutuhanin mo. Pero it's just that threat. You know, it's like saying, you, you cannot do that. If you issue a challenge, it better be gawin mo. Mas maganda, wag ka nang magsalita. Kasi wala naman akong in-issue na challenge sa'yo eh. Nangyari ito, even pandemic. Why is that? Abusado kasi anak mo, pinaluhod mo, tinutukan mo ng barili. Because mm -hmm. nobody, you know, akala mo, kung ikay kaliwat ka anang, pinapatay mo ng parang manok yung mga nasa baluarte mo. I, I told him, wag mong gagawin sa Maynila yan. Kasi pag nag-encuentro tayo. Ben, an alin ang nauna? Yung, uh, yung image ng tour for na matapang? O kahit na wala pa yung television, mm. wala pa yung media, mm. eh talagang ganun kayong magkakapatid? Let me explain a little bit. My father was in the military and wala kaming stable environment. So we'll be transferred from one mm. province to the other. Lahat na bully na tikman ko eh. And so being a bully, you have to fight the bully. And so sa school, iba nung araw eh. Whether high school ka na o, o, o elementary ka, susubukan ka eh. So it becomes part of that. Nabata pa lang kami. Nag-aaral ako ng judo, boxing, mm -hmm. hanggang sa pag... Uh, Naging kahiligan ko na Shotokan Karate, Jitkundu, you know, freestyle, all that. Yun ang dahilan na siguro dahil of the environment. Parang natur para I I'll speak no. for myself. Yeah. I speak for myself. Uh, alam ko naman si Rafi is his own way. Mm -hmm. Ang brand talaga na, man. I really am. Kung iba sabihin, tapang ka lang naman. Yeah, matapang ako kung talagang kinanti ako. Pero if not, you know, I'm just... I'm, Quiet ako na guy eh. I have to show myself na ide-defend mo yung mga tao tapos yung pala kaya ka maraming bodyguard eh. You know, my bodyguard is just a tobacco by myself. Siguro kung patas ang labanan, I can defend myself. Whatever it is, a weapon or no weapon, fine. Because you happen to also be trained martial arts. Yes. In martial arts. Yes. Right. Uh, that much is, ano, uh, I think, well known. Uh, but itong image or reputation ng matapang, sabi natin, personality ng matapang, no, matiga, tigasin. Dala ba ito ng ano? Da, galing ba ito sa tatay niyo? Okay. Um, na dating sundalo? Yes. Um, my father was really courageous, brave, uh, high principle, and, and, and sinabi sa amin. Napapalo ba kayo? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah nadidisiplina kami. But on my side, idol ko yung father ko eh. From among the brothers, ako yung nagmana sa father ko. Which basically, nag-resonate para, nag-echo yung sinasabi niya, Ben, pag gusto mong ita, ilaban yung tama, ilaban mo, pero may consequence yan. It might be your life. Mm -hmm. So be careful, panchay mo. But my father, religious, kaya na balance eh. Religious, uh, total empathy, 
and uh, you know uh, compassion so na balance eh. and from your mother what did you get well uh, you kaya siguro itong public service eh. why because my mother would be takbuhan ng mga asawa ng sundalo na nagrereklamo sa father ko and i will be out there nakikita ko adjacent to my room ano reklamo hindi wala nang sustento isa yon uh, hindi umuuwi etc uh. so my father would come in and Along the road, because Philippine constabulary, we like mm. military, ani. Eh. Yeah. Tatawag niya. Ayusin mo ba to? O hindi? Or gusto mo itapong kita sa basilan? Tapong kita sa lo? Medyo yung misses papa lang. So it's a solution. But my father, my mom would be yung pagumalis na sa kita niyo. Kakaawa sila, no? You're all lucky. So we're taught about compassion. Doon na umpisa yung awa. Meron yung serapi. Meron yung serwin. Inherent na sa amin na siya. Isa lang naman ang dumadaloy sa dugo, dito sa ugat namin, ano yung dugo, na tumutulong kami. Yan, nandun yung tapang, brusko, pero may meron yung awa. Meron yung madali ka maawa. Isipin mo kung wala yun, pareho na rin brusko, sunto ka na lang tayo. I'm glad na meron kaming mother who, who taught us compassion. Always say that, you know, you're so lucky because God gave you this and that. So, makikita mo kay Rafi yan. Makikita mo kay Erwin. Makikita mo sa amin, mga tool ko yan. Siguro, kung ang mother ko rin, eh, hindi kami tinuro na, para siguro, you are now in trouble. And then, sinasabi ng mother ko, ikaw, Ben, pag hindi mo tinapyas yung tapang mo, baka makulong ka eh. And then, I'm afraid ako nung magdasal ka. Well, would you say, Ben, that ikaw ang pinakapasaway? You're the most pasaway among the hindi, siblings? Hindi ako eh. Kasi sinasabi nila, I, I, I've heard this said, no? Uh, si Ben kasi, you did not, there was a time you did not grow up with the rest of your siblings. Yes. Um, you were uh, adopted uh, by an aunt. My aunt, you know, uh, for two years, napunta ako sa kanila. And so... And why was this? Siguro, paborito ako eh. Gusto nila ako na natin. So... Ikaw yung pinaka-cute siguro. Ang bata ka. Kaya ikaw yung hiningi. Siguro kung sa tuta, ako yung medyo, <laughs> ako yung medyo cute. <laughs> kung sa tuta, kung pag nagpilian mo, ito, 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 gusto ko to. Masunurin kasi ako eh, masunurin ako. Pero kung, kung pasaway, hindi, yung maloko ako. Maloko? Hindi ko na sasabihin kung sino yung may layas, as uh -huh. in sto stokwa, stowaway, uh -huh. may... Kung titingnan ko... Matatawa ka sa mga karakter ng mga magkakapatid na ito. Oh, sige, paano? Paliwanag natin. Let's, let's see. No? Erwin would be what? Good boy. The good boy. Kasi yes. bunso. Bunso. Masunuri palagi, oo, sa paborito ng nanay? Ganun ba yan? Yes. Paborito, paborito ng, ng nanay. Ng tatay. Malambing? Malambing, yes. Okay. This is, that's, that's the asset. Pero, alam mo yung bunso, minsan, dahil paborito sila, they get away with a lot of things. Siya rin ba yung pinakapilyo? No. He's, he's really nice. He's really Mabay nice. Siya. Mabay. Okay. And then Rafi would be? Uh, Ayan. Patigil ka. <laughs> uh, mabait din yan. Mm -hmm. Pero tulad ko, may top up. Mm -hmm. So, kumaga, do not mess with him. Kasi madaling makante. Pero mabilis din maawa. Mabilis, oh. din, mabilis din bumalik sa kanyang situations. Parang, he's a pleaser just like me. A pleaser? Yeah, he wants to please people. He, yung parang... I don't know. So you're basically saying, ikaw si Rafi ang mas magkaugali. Uh, kaya rin ba, kaya rin ba, minsan, kasi naalala ko sa T3, ben, kaya yung madras, nagtatalo, nag-aaway din eh. Di ba? Nag, nagkakaintindihan kami kasi kung totoo man sinasabi, uh, yung isang subject sign namin, pareho kami eh, na Pisces eh. Hmm. Ako, 15 siya, 12. So we know each other in terms of you know kung totoo man to yung thinking magkaiba lang templada sa yung temper at saka disposition magkaiba. And you would be older than Rafi. Yes. Yeah. So there were clashes. Kayo madalas na nag-aaway. Uh, growing up as boys. No. Uh, we would have, you know, siguro discussions or conflict in terms of, you know, I mean issues lang. Pero doon sa physical hindi nakikipagsuntukan ako hindi kay Rafi kasi yun sa ibang kapatid ko Ma next sa akin pati nga doon sa matanda yeah, 
Bakit kayong tatlo lang? Well, let's count uh, Kuya Mon. Ano? Okay. How come it's just the four of you actually went to went into television? What people don't probably know is there's a lot more two of us around. Siblings, diba? But there's just four who actually went to television with the same hard-hitting brand. All right. Single. Why the four of you? Well, first, I think it's more of the... Yung na-influence, ano? It's like saying... Ako talaga, Pat, you know, I wasn't really influenced by Mon because I was really a disc jockey, DJ hmm. away. So, kilala yung mga stations namin, uh, medyo, alam mo naman ang mga disc Playing na. what music before you continue? Oh, well, it's just like, you know, mga pop music, uh, this music or popular music, hindi yung mga typical na nung araw, baduy. Hmm. So, iba yung niche namin. English hero, hmm. and that's it. So, uh, Oh, this explains your English. Exactly. It's a very DJ yes, English and, and, guy. And then Siguro on the, on the States also. It stayed there for quite a long time. So at the same time, yung sinasabi ko, I graduate talaga on journalism. Mm -hmm. So that's why. And then, magkahilig lang kami because ako, going back, high school pala ako, DJ na ako. So, magkahilig lang kami, Siguro, Um, si Erwin would visit me during the time na nasa FMO. Si Rafi would. So it might have been Si Rafi went into the province and decided to become a DJ too. Si Erwin really took it by heart na mag-aaral ng uh, magsulat. So nagkasabay-sabay lang. So in fact, dito nga sa TV5 na nagkaroon ng parang siguro and the annual of broadcast. At lumag ka kapatid sa isang mm -hmm. programa. Actually, apat kami. Find it sa history ng Philippine media. Apat, grabe yung influence. Well, there's also two dead generations na tulfo. Si Lamon, baba kay Wanda, ibang generations na. Mm -hmm. Senior. Lamo, T3, kami. no? Parang talagang tulfo overload ang nangyari doon. Yes, 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 yes. It was like, you know, as if one were not enough. And, and alam three. mo, historic din yung nagawa ng TV5 noon, ano? I was lucky because I was given the opportunity na sinama ako sa mga kapatid namin kasi, kasi doon na buo yung T3. Doon kami sumikat talaga. Doon talaga kami nakilala because it was different. Three brothers helping people. It's almost like a movie. Yes. A Hollywood movie. And, 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 a Hollywood and, casting. Ano? Yeah, and at the same time, may entertainment value yeah, also. Right, right. So, hindi lahat puro tapang. Tatawa na kami. Uh, may tapang, minsan, magagalit, all emotions lumalabas. And that's the brand in TV. Do you remember that episode when, um, ano ko, uh, after that Claudine Barreto incident mm. at the airport, mm. no, I think, uh, yes, pinrif pa namin kayo. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> T3, no? And then everybody agreed to behave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, everybody agreed to behave. I remember that. <laughs> We, And then I think what happened was that it was the first time that you saw actually what happened to your brother. Yes. The video, when we played back the video on, exactly. on the screen, mm -hmm. I think doon nagsimula, medyo nagalit na kayo. Yes. Hanggang before you know it, yeah. all three brothers were already yeah. well, well, hurling you know, challenges. Was at a, ang ginawa yeah. nun, suspendido. Yes, 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 yes. Well, um, I remember that we just got carried away uh -huh. by our emotions. Siguro brother mo kasi. But, you know, if that were to happen now, medyo tapered siguro. Alam mo naman kami, mga hmm. Bruce ko eh, pinagsama-sama mo. Eh, nagsalita yung isa, sumunod yung isa, sumunod yung isa. Kuyo ganda tayo. Alam mo, as a, as a producer back then, ano, siyempre we were in production. Mm -hmm. ang, ang, uh, ito, no, ang, ang takeaway ko doon, medyo ang tingin ko sa inyong magkakapatid, puro tatlong alpha male. Eh. Yes. Nagkukompetensya uh -huh. sa isa't isa. Uh -huh. So at that moment, hindi kayo papayag na kailangan. Yes. Yun ang nangyari na episode na yun. Ah, yeah, uh, nag <laughs> Patapangan na nangyari. <laughs> Am I wrong? Are, are we You're wrong? You're right. <laughs> huh? You're right. Parang ganon. <laughs> well, um, iba na yung level ng ano, kasi iba-iba uh, yung aming yun, narratives mm -hmm. and ability ng salita. Uh, parang ako ata yung dinemanda ng medyo iba eh. Yeah. Because my... Do you remember was, what you said? Yeah. Oh, okay. Would, I you, would you want to repeat or, it? Anyway, that's or, all well, remember, buried in the past. Yeah. Sinabi ko, that time, parang, it's just anyway, pinag-usapan, mm -hmm. na wala tayo sa puting tabing, totoong mundo, tinutugis namin mga kriminal. 
hindi kami, hindi, lalo na ako sa bitan. Gusto mo, dat, tatlo lang yung magagawa. Tanggapin mo, tanggihan mo, baliwalain mo sa warehouse. Let's lock it up. Last man standing. Ambulance waiting. I remember that. Hanggang ngayon, to this day, you remember yes. the very lines that you, na binitawan mo. Yes. In short, And, naghamon ka. Mag, mag challenge sang ang lusot lang namin doon may escape ka naman eh don't 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 it's not you know when you challenge somebody give them choices hmm. anggapin mo well baliwalain mo or tanggihan mo so sinabi ng judge oh marami naman palang choices dito eh bakit mga tapos binigyan kami na lalo na sa akin pag nakita ako sa mall nakatabi yung sinasabing nagrereklamo ako unang nalabas. Eh, kung ako na una sa mall, dahil nakita kami, lugi at ako ron. Para sa akin lang yon, Kasi sila Rafi, sila Erwin, hindi, hindi ganun eh. So, parang nakasentro sa akin, siguro yung actor na yun, nakita niya na hindi kami totoo, na totoo kami. Hmm. Hindi kami nagbibiro. And then, nangyari din yan, nung kay Erwin na naghamon. Nangyari ito, nang hamon. Uh, we were all there for a win. Yeah. And that was the time na nag-antay kami. Hindi naman nakakita. I remember that. Okay, so... Nasa ABS pa si ABS yes. even pa si Erwin yun. And, At uh, I think ang nakakiskisan was si Sir Mondano. Ikaw nang baga. Alalo ko yan. Parang actually, hmm. pumunta sa ano, sa yeah. Amoranto? Was it Amoranto And Stadium? Uh, dito sa may... Um, Quezon City. It's a gym na nag, nag-antay kami roon. Eh, oh. yan, ano, si Richard Gomez, oh. uh, kung sino-sino lahat na mga naglabasan kasi. Nagpakita kami ng, sige. So, si rest back, rest back. Yung, tatlong, yung magkakapatid talagang Si Erwin naman kasing hinamon ni. Eh. Oo. Oh, oh. so, Pero you showed up? Nag, nag, well, we have to, to show up. Walang mm-hmm. ang ba ng papabayaan? Yung punso namin yun. Eh. Tumawag ba si Erwin o hindi na kailangan tumawag? Hindi. Alam na namin ang, kasi nag-issue ng challenge. Uh, the day and the place. Mojo Jim at the time, eh. mm-hmm. malapit sa ABS. Eh, nagpakita kami. Mm-hmm. Eh, hindi naman, nagpak- hindi naman sumipot sa anumang kadahilanan. Siya lang nakakaalam. But, of course. So, Erwin does not need to say, Ben, Kuya Ben, no, no. samahan mo ako. No, no, no. In fact, sinabi pa nga ni Erwin, hindi na kailangan. Hindi. Eh, doon, doon kami. Palangan ba naman, parang hindi tayo mm-hmm. magkakapatid niyan. So, lumabas. Ito naman si Mon. Nauna nang inoccupy ng gym, nag-boxing na. Oh. Sabi namin, oops. O di, nagpa- si, si, si Rafi na. ba pumunta rin? Hindi Oo. Hmm. Ito si Rafi, pumunta ako. Nang nang tool for bars. And na. one more incident, ano, Ben. Dito naman sa TV5. <laughs> <laughs> ano ko eh, kiskisa ni Edling Gao at ni Erwin Tulfo. Yung sagutan nila sa Facebook. Well, okay. At least wala wala hindi wala hamunan sa gym. No, no, no. Okay. No, 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 sa Facebook no, no. nagkahamunan. Eh, okay. Yes. Sa TV. Uh, medyo rumes baka rin. Di ba? Well, siguro I'm my brother's keeper because I'm the eldest among the three. And and syempre naman, uh, for whatever reasons I have my reasons why I have to interfere and stand up. Kaya naman ni Erwin. Uh-huh. But because I cannot take it for whatever reasons baka baka it might spill over na ganun lang pala ang mga tulfo. So I have to show that I can enforce. Baka kumalat sa ibang, ibang kumalat sa ibang channel, hindi totoo ako. I'll stand up always for my brother. At doon sa insidente na yun, nagtapos yes. ang mga, yes. ang karir ni Ben at ni Erwin sa TV5. <laughs> yes, uh, well, that was also, also a blessing in disguise. Uh, we grew up. You, you were, no, let's just, for all terms, this is all history. Yes. You were being suspended and you didn't take it. You did rather leave and Well, resign. I was suspended. Uh, I couldn't take it because I don't have any contract. So I mm. could just simply be, all I need to do is just tap my shoulder and say, hey, it's not coming. Okay, fine. I don't know, I didn't see it. When you were, were you served, served the suspension, I didn't I, see it. Oh, well, it was given to me and then have to put return to sender. In, uh, tapos, wala namang pagpupunit na nangyari? Wala naman. Uh, nilagay, tapos pinako sa security ko, ibalik mo. Mm-hmm. Is there's, there's no contract. Why suspend a person doesn't have any contract? Okay. Unless I sign a contract, then I am obligated. And so there are those, you know... So you, you decided it was, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Of and course. You, um, you were willing to give up. Meaning to say, nagtatanim ka ba with all these scrapes and these uh, scuffles, these fights that you've been with people, 
So do, do you, does it stay in you? I mean, Alam mo ako yung tao, oh, hindi ako nagtatanim. I'm always, pag once nakita ko na uh, kahit na mag-reach out na sa akin, it's not an over with. Pag nakita ko naman at uh, he's going through rough times, I'll be the first one to come and say, hey, just forget about it. So nangyari, real talk. It kind of demonstrates how Katulfo, so, no? a yes. strong family brand, yes. a band of brothers. Yes. You know? It's almost Hollywoodish, no? <laughs> Parang ganun, ano? Uh, sabay-sabay kayo aangat, mm. pero pag may nangyari, minsan sabay-sabay din kayo tatamaan pa baba. Yes, in a way, na parang... Together you rise, together you fall. Yeah, united we stand, united mm. we fall. Mm. <laughs> And you have, I don't know, there have been episodes when you have fallen. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh, that's part of life, success and failure, you know? You know, sometimes pain and pleasure, good times and bad times. Hindi ka naman magiging kompleto kung puro good times eh. I think that the test of a person is experiencing all the challenges to which nakita namin yun. Through those times, do you think na I will bounce back? For example, I'll, I'll, I'll mention this time when uh, uh, your Kuya Mon Tulfo mm. had a quarrel with then first gentleman, Mike Arroyo. I, I think ang nangyari, ang consequence nun, all the three brothers yes. lost their TV shows. Okay. Right? Uh, at that point, did you did you think na this is it, we're done? Or did you were confident now we will bounce back somehow? I played a role where, you know, I was a really independent. So the three of them together, with Prescott and wala sila. So I was the one uh, na lumulutang, and they were going after me. But I have to go to the palace. And salamat naman kay Secretary Mita to say, don't touch it. Then, uh, sa government kasi all the time, sa IBC TV 13. Tapos, I have to use my show to make sure na, come here, Ralph. come here, Erwin, let's do it. Then we decided to join forces doing all these... Uh, yung sa drug operations sa Pampanga. Nagsama-sama kami tatlo. And then it all started na si Erwin joined me. Mm-hmm. But Rafi was okay sa, sa well, sa um, RMN. And Mon, medyo nahirapan siya because he was the leader then. Mm-hmm. Ako kasi, who will I yell? But it all went not yun ang sinasabi namin. Nagkaroon ng way na para pareho pa rin kaming bumangon. Mm-hmm. Siguro pa, sabi nila, nasa palad daw eh. Guhit ng palad eh. There's such thing as divine destiny and human destiny. Okay. And then, can we talk about the 60 million? Okay. Kasi that was also what, an episode what? in your life where ikaw naman yes. personally was yeah, involved yeah, yeah. A good in thing. that uh, 60 million peso Yeah. deal with the Department of uh, Tourism. Okay. Is there little... something we don't know yet? All right. Let, uh, that hasn't good... been reported in the uh, news? All right. Because the, the money went to you. You refused to return it. You, well, still, but... you still believe that it was a clean deal? No, no, no. Uh, okay, let's, let's start in the beginning. Mm-hmm. The good thing na na open up niyan. It is a government-to-government project. Mm-hmm. It's between the PCOO and the Department of Tourism. Government-to-government right. project. So... The PCO, wala kami pakialam doon because we're a private entity. So the PCO decided to, to, you know, get the services of the government also, which is PTB4. So sa PTB4 decided to, you know, look at the situation, so make a placement doon kasi magkakasama kami. Sikat yung programa namin eh. Na sinasabi nitong si Gordon, ay, saan ba si Gordon yan? Na wala raw puwente yung palabas. No, he's wrong. We were loading it over yung kilos pronto. So nilagay ngayon ang PTB4, naglagay ng placement per minute sa so segment and placement. So we charge them on the basis of what is the okay. amount by PTB4. Okay. Now, in other words, naglagay sila ng placement sa amin. It's like general contractor, government to government, general contractor, sinab contra kami to put that. Right. Where's the problem? Okay. So nagkaroon ng Senate hearing. It was more like a circus of Gordon, Trellanes, Honteberos, isa lang ang hinangaan ko ron, si Binay, he, she understood for, pretty well. Nung sinabmit sa ombudsman, 
tinignan ng ombudsman, worst na petition, sino nagnakaw? Na-deliver namin. Kasi alam mo, advanced na yung technology ng uh, bitag eh. Naka-tricaster kami. Hmm. Lahat sinabmit namin, all delivered, sobra pa. Up to this date, hindi kami nabayaran doon sa services namin. Kung pagsasauli mo yon yung servisyong napakita namin, delivered dutifully and willfully. So in other words, that's illegal enrichment sa gobyerno. Pribado ako eh. Hindi ako pwede magnakaw. Bayaran mo ako sa service ko because na-deliver yun. So now, think, if, you okay. if, you, if you return that, what does it mean? Libre ang servisyo namin. Pinahirapan naman kami. Nakalibre ang gobyerno. Nakalibre yung, governor, uh, yung, go, go, yung gobyerno na time. No, hindi ko po pwede. Kaya sabi ko, mamuting mata nyo, hindi ko sasauli. Okay. Bakit? Trinabaho namin yun eh. Pakialam namin doon sa issue ninyo. Kung, nag, kung kayo nasa politika, wala kaming pakialam, basta't kami, delivered. Kaya nung dumating sa ombudsman, nag-file ng kaso, nag-senate hearing, pinorward sa ombudsman, nabasura. End Don't story. you think, looking back, it would have been more prudent, you would have avoided all this, if uh, you would have not gone into the contract? Only because your sister was Secretary of Tourism then, and the money was coming from the Department of Tourism, even yeah. though there was no, well, as you say, direct, direct negotiation between your sister and you. You tell me, what's the case? Prudence. Prudence. Wouldn't prudence Define have prudence. dictated that? Uh, Define prudence. Uh, okay. Delicadesa. What's, why, why, why delicadesa? Hmm. Did we... Hindi maganda tingnan. Well, yeah. okay, well, that's, that's the other side of the coin. Hindi maganda tingnan. Well, tingnan mo muna yung layer. Government to government? Wala kaming pakialan. Government station? Naglagay ng placement sa amin. Well, we're only accountable sa people's television. Mm -hmm. That's... That is yung... Our principal. Bayaran mo kami. Wala kaming pakialam sa DOT. Wala kaming pakialam sa PCOO. Ikaw ang kumuha ng service namin, nilagay mo rito. So, okay. I don't care kung si Juan Dateo or si Martin Andanar, kung si Presidente Duterte ma, who gives a hoot? But Ben, you're, 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 you have a public image and no, reputation to protect, for example. No, we're talking about legalities. Yeah. Legalities, okay. that seems to be, you know, let's yes. put us aside. But in terms of uh, preserving your, your public image or your, or your reputation, okay, don't you think it would have been more prudent not to? I mean, uh, given the chance... Would you, would you have decided otherwise? Mm, I don't think so. Because I'm a strong-willed individual and I know what's moral and I know what's legal. So I stand on a moral high ground and I have a higher common sense in terms of logic, rationality and reasons and I have a higher wisdom. So that's my answer. <coughs> After all, we have a court of law. I do not stand and I will not flinch in the court of public opinion. I will stand on the basis of what the court says. Let the court decide. That's a proper forum. The court, a proper court. So, the man tunes a proper court. I don't care what, what they say <coughs> because if you look back, the history will say, hey, wala to eh. Well, talk to the ombudsman kung ano nakita nila. As a matter of fact, a good thing nilabas big issue niyan. Maraming naingit sa media, and I sabihin sa mga big networks, sinabi, tuloy yan yun yan, mga tool po. What do you think to know about that? So, naging interested tuloy ang ombudsman. Why? Ah, ingit. That was it. So, legally, morally, I can say, without batting my eyelashes, I stood on a moral high ground. Well, moral high ground means what's moral, what's legal. We didn't steal any money. Why would I return someday? Some, something. Para tuloy pinagbabayad mo kami ng service na servisyo, na deliver naman namin. Wala namang masama. Magkaroon sila ng bidding. There's a bidding. So, what's, what's delicadesa? Kung ninakaw mo, what's delicadesa? Hindi ka dumaan ng bidding. May bidding sila doon eh. Kami dineliver namin. Hindi naman kami, wala naman kami pakialam kung may Juan Dateo or Martin Andanaro, Duterte or PTV4, gobyerno, you pay us because we mm. delivered the service. Okay. So, pagdating sa politika, that's politics. Okay, uh, fast forward to, to now. Yes. Okay, dalawang tulpo nag-uunahan sa taas okay. in the surveys for senatorial uh, candidates.
Okay. Normally, pag dalawang magkapatid, naghahatakan pababa. Now, we're seeing Irwin and you. Nag-uunahan sa taas. The essence of democracy is that you will have to win the election. So, people will decide. It's not the mindset or perception of people. Let's have to put it legally. Legally speaking. Well, I, I guess the question would have to be this, you know. Uh, what does it say about our elections? Okay. Or, or the public okay. sentiment? That uh, okay. two tulfos mm -hmm. are racing to the top of this in the in the surveys. They're seeing something, but not seeing others to others. Number one. Una, I can only speak for myself. I'm not going to speak for Erwin. The mm -hmm. Wamaragita walang dynasty. Define dynasty. There's a territory. There is because uh, that's una hanagita. Political dynasty. You have to have a kingdom. That's why. Dynasty or always a Tang Dynasty, whatever in the China, in, in China, that's dynasty. Minamana. Minamana. Oh. Not only that, you have a kingdom. Hindi minamana pinapasa mo to preserve that. You don't do that sa amin sa tatlo. If we make it to the top, it's the people's choice. We don't have any. Wala kami, wala kami uh, baluarte. Hindi namin pwedeng bayarin mga tao, manipula mga tao. Hindi namin stilo. Oh, uh, Erwin, yung kamo na, ako mo na ha. That trabaho ng dynasty yun. Nag-uusap-usap kung sino ang mauna. No. Kasi iba yung brand ko, iba yung advocacy ko, iba yung brand ni Irwin. Anong nakikita ng mga tao? Bakit nasa, sa, nasa survey kami? Ang daming mga season naman dyan, mga sikat. Eh bakit nangunguna kami? May nakita sila. The essence of democracy is for the people, by the people, of the people. Well, the greater number will decide. When Parang the Irwin though is not happy with you running. Because he probably feels, I'm just speculating well, here, that um, cheese you, you, would, you would eat into his votes. Well, cheese me siya. Doon sa mga demonyong nag So is it okay? Are you, is, is er, would you say that Erwin is perfectly fine with you running? As a matter of fact, I love Erwin because marami nagsasabi, tulungan natin si Kuya Ben. Tulungan natin yung okay. This is now? Yes. But a few months back, was there some misgivings at least from Erwin uh, Kuya Ben, wag naman. Ben dynasty yan. Huh? Political dynasty niyan. Pag ganon. <laughs> Pag ganon. We don't belong to political dynasty. Uh -huh. Kasi mga political dynasty, may baluarte. Eh, wag ka muna, Totoy. O si ate mo muna. O oh, ikaw, asawa ko. Ikaw, Ay, sunod ka na. We don't play that game. So, from the start, Erwin was fine and okay with you running for the Senate? Why would, why would I... Why would I give a hoot kung anong feeling or sentiment niya? I'm a man, he's his man, Papi's his man. So we're not, it's not a question of decisions of giving because si Irwin respect me because I am his kuya. Nakapagsabi ka ba kay Irwin na... Do I need his permission? Okay. Who's the elder brother? Okay. Okay, Who's not the... permission, but did you at least tell him? Well, hey, this is something that well, I'm sure well, brothers would have okay. discussed or talked about. Okay, on his birthday, just para ma maintindihan ng mga tao na yung mga chismoso, yung mga intrigero, intrigera, lalo-lalo kung sino-sino dyan. During Irwin's birthday, I spoke there sa platform niya to say, I'd like Irwin to be number one second to none. Mm. And then after that, because I really need it, I'd like him to be number one second to none. I'm proud of him because it's a tool for I'm a tool for. Marami lang nagsasabing, marami na kayo. So what? So, ibabasura kami ng tao, mm. we'll take it to the chin. Mm. Pag inelect kami, maganda para sa tao. Okay. So, para mo sinabi, too much na yung titre na yan, tanggalin mo na yan. In the same situations, I will do it sa Senado. So, bakit wala nag... Ba, Doon ba sa titre, may nagsabi ba, tanggalin mo na si Ben, tanggalin mo, kaya na ng dalawa na yan. But then again, it was the decision na parang it was the network decision. Dito naman, sa tao yan. So, hindi pinag-uusapan ng magkakapalit. O sinabi ni Rafi, Kuya Ben, wag ka nang pumasok dito sa T3 kasi nandito na ako. O, o dalawa na, too much. One is enough, two is too much, three is danger, four is poison that can kill a person. Walang ganun. So, why now go into the Senate? It's, it's the higher calling and you're basically talking about what is this? The sense of purpose. I just find it hard to uh, believe, ano, uh, Ben, ano, that hindi nyo napag-uusapan. Napag Even, let's say, hindi para magpaalam, pero magsabi man lang na, Uy, Erwin, tatakbo ako. Ah. Yeah, yeah. On his birthday, I said, I said, Erwin, 
if there was a sum as a uh, admin, mm -hmm. I'll leave you there. You know what he said? We're both gonna make it. We're both gonna make it. Yes, mananalo tayong pareho. It's a birthday niya yun. Oh, that's August. So, how about with Rafi? Oh, okay, Rafi can say, I love Rafi. He said, we're not independent. Sabi ni Rafi. Well, I'm going to you, Rafi. Siguro ang issue sa mga ingitero sa baba kung sino-sino pa. Voting block ba kayo sa Senado? <laughs> Pag nagkataon, T3 sa Senado, is that a voting block? Depends kung ano yung... Uh, iba, iba kung ano yung nilalatag kasi alam sa Senate, it's about inquiry, investigation, legislation. Mm. You have to win legislation with the, well, but you have to convince your colleagues in the Senate. So if that's a good, if that's a good, you know, whatever it is na ipapasa mo, at naniwala ako dyan, at kay Tool Erwin yan, kay Tool Rapp, it's with the good of the people, why would I not block you? Well, are, are you well, more are more are you three brothers more likely to vote together? Well, well, let's not talk about legislation, but for example, Senate leadership. Alam mo naman yan sa pag uh, issue ng Senate leadership, di ba? Minsan na na de decide yan sa boto ng tatlo o apat na senador. Maguusap maguusap usap naman kami ng rapi ni Erwin Jan. Mm -hmm. Maguusap kayo. Yes. And natural lang. Natural. Alang ba naman ko kontra kontra kami? Solid you know, kayo. There's only one because you know I'd like to make sure na solid kami hindi kami pwedeng ihatiin hindi kami pwedeng gabain marami kasi diyan masamang uh, intensyon ang gustong gawin gibain kami at hahati-hatiin kami no ako yung fiscalizer that you can take to the bank okay uh, I'd like to go back to what we talked about earlier mm -hmm. uh, you, you got a call to be a guest candidate in the administration slate Hindi pa naman official yet. Until it's official, they should, they should announce it. Why would it be coming from me? But there yeah, are fillers. There, there's a filler, there's yes. Well, well, doon sa parting yan, wala pa naman tayo na, na, natatanggap na official invitation to say, join us. And, well, kung may invitation man, you have to make that announcement, not me. Ikaw partido eh. Guess mo ako eh. Parang pupunta ka ba sa bahay na wala kang invitasyon? Asa ang invitation mo? Ba't ako papasok sa bahay mo? May bahay naman ako. Kapag uusapan naman, ako may bahay. Si Ben Tulfo, may bahay. At yung bahay ko, number two. Sa preference ng mga tao. Kung papasok naman ako sa bahay, na dami sila doon, kung sino-sino, magkaibang partido, hindi mo malaman, chapsoy, para lang magkasama-sama sila, I don't think winning the election is not about the party. Your platform. Okay. In all likelihood, let's say that both of you will top this election, okay. this midterm election in 2025. And you know what happens among usually for those who mm. top the elections? Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe not for everyone, but it's all, you uh, know, it's almost automatic that whoever tops it becomes a presidential vote or a vice presidential vote. Mm -hmm. And this will be for 2028. Uh, are, 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 I'm sure that that plays on your mind too, on your head too, the possibility of higher office in 2028, especially because if you top this election, no, Ben, um, even if you lose, let's say, in 2028 for president or vice president, you will still be a senator. You, you, you will be in a very sweet spot in 2028 because uh, you don't have to choose. You can have both. Okay. I can run, and if I don't make it, I can go back and finish my term as senator. Let me talk about first. So that's very, that's it kind of major okay. and enticing, yana, huh? your, right. your situation. Yeah. I'll take you to where I'd like you to take to, to, to listen. Mm. I will not preempt God. Anybody who talks about tomorrow is already sinning because we're preempting God. Only God knows what's tomorrow. So there's still, there's, 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 it's sinful when you talk about tomorrow because tomorrow may never come. I'm a man of faith because I'm a Christian. So now, answering the question, maganda yan sinasabi mo, I will protect my brothers. Kahit sino sa kanila. What do you mean by I will protect my brothers? When I say I will protect my brothers, this means Rafi and Erwin. 
You will give way to your brothers? I will protect my brothers, Robbie and Erwin. If, is, it calls, is, if, it, if it calls for their, you know, really na gibaan na, then I will be taking care of business. Take it from there. So you're saying it's more likely to be Rafi or Irvin? Well, it's your guess. I'll keep it on my chest. Okay, not you. No, I'm not going to say it publicly because I know I will be a fiscalizer. I will be my brother's keeper. I want to make sure that when they get sila. May 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 gantian, may dating. Kung baga kung sa T3, don't do it. Would like to serve the people, and the people have to choose. I will be the enforcer. I want to make sure na hindi sila magigiba. If somebody else will try to do it, kaya naman namin lumaban eh. I mean, I'm kaya ko naman ilaban eh. If the going gets tough and the tough gets going. Somebody else will have to take care of business. Ikaw yun? No, I'm not sure. Somebody else will have to take care of business. So, para sa akin, I will protect both my brothers. Kasi alam ko naman, may mangyayari. Mm. 